Hello, hello everybody. I'm so sorry it's taken me so long to make another video. Uh, I was just been crazy and drama and all that. But anyway, back to Star Wars. I wanted to, I did the ATAT -AT video and I don't think I did a good enough job. So I just want to show again real quick before we get into the Kylo Ren's that the heavy assault walker, he, I call it the gorilla, uh, the gorilla walker, as you can see. This is the Hot Wheels one. This is the only one I've seen anywhere. When I had to grab it. I I never got the Black Series ATT, and they haven't come out with any Black Series ships. I don't think, at least not in uh, South Carolina. But anyway, I want I want to go over the basics. It says it's die cast. Okay, comes with a little platform to sit on, stand on. It's very stable in the most positions. Here, that's the good. And all this, all this part right here is die cast. That's obviously metal as well. Now the legs are and head are completely plastic. As I can demonstrate. And here's the thing. Look uh, closely. It looks like they should bend. Go, you know, go forward, go back. This is as far back as you could get it, and as far as, but in the front, you can't get the. So whatever the special trick is, I have a feeling, um, Lucasfilm stepped in and said, "Hey, we can't, you know, we can't show that off," and so, I mean, that's kind of ridiculous if you're selling the item. I mean, it's still cool, but take a look at this. I hope it will focus. I'm gonna try to tap it lightly. Focus on there. There, you see that? That's a cannon. It's actually a screw. I mean, it's literally a screw. I don't know if you can see. It's literally a screw they just put in there to be the cannon. But you can tell that that the new one is got a lot more firepower. It's got uh, one, two, three, four, two heavy cannons on the side of the head, two of the blasters in the front. It's got this heavy cannon screw. <laughs> um, I have a feeling in the final version, this part slide will slide up because obviously we have here four, and we have these four gigantic, gigantic uh, bombs or whatever they are, shells, cannon shells. So it, I truly believe it's going to be able to move into a, like a two-legged standing position to shoot down uh, anything really um, so that that's that's the review on that I would still get it it was only $4.99 but just don't expect it to be die cast all right let's get into let's get into it uh, I thought my I thought the uh, Kylo Ren um, uh, SDC SDCC would be a good background so went for that um, Oops, let's see. So, basically, um, do I have a good... Okay, I think I have a pretty good view here going. Basically, this one, the one that's cheap right now, right? It's the exact same one as that. The only difference is I get a helmet I can put on him. I have Darth Vader's burnt helmet. It's the same saber, and then, of course, you get the flag. I mean, that's cool, but, you know... Uh, I, I wouldn't even resell them because something fell on them. I'd, lo I'd love to trade it, to be honest, and get, like, something I need really bad. Like some Praetorian guards or something, but whatever. Um, so th this, th this and this... Excuse me. These two have... The only difference is that this has the helmet. This was the first one to come out. And it had, the. if you look at the lightsaber, it tried to give it that little flame thing. Then they went here, and they tried to give it a little bit more flame thing, but also make it a little neater, you know. Um, and th I don't have the, the currently, this is the lights, the extra lightsaber that snap onto his belt is in my accessory box i just didn't want to grab it um the one that came with this uh i think i paid three dollars for this kylo ren on amazon uh every thursday check amazon great deals usually um 
what I do is I just put everything, all the Black Series, anything I want in my cart. And then I just check it every morning and then maybe every few hours. And, you know, it'll tell you important items for your cart. Check your cart. Now, um, I'm sorry, they're, they're a little difficult to, they don't, they don't stand very, very well. Um, I don't know why. I think it's because of the, you know, and this is cool though. If you can see what I'm showing, it kind of goes with the whole samurai vibe that they're going to probably rely heavily on with the Praetorian guards and everything. Come on, stand for me, buddy. All right, come on, man. You've been with me a long time. You can stand. There you go. All right, he's standing. Okay, so here we go with the new one. Well, first I want to show you the lightsaber. Okay, this is the extra lightsaber that comes with with the uh, Tipo. I'm going to try to tap the camera without messing that up so that it'll highlight it. Okay, there we go. You've got gold, you've got, I mean, a lot of detail, a lot of paint detail. I love it. Okay, here's the new one, right? The one that we're supposed to be so excited about, the one that we're supposed to spend so much money for. Take a look at this. Oh. <laughs> it has no gold features. It's got the same shape, uh, but look there, there's there's really nothing going on now this could be his own changes in the movie maybe he straightened up made it less bulky but it doesn't look like it if you compare him side to side it's, it just looks like a cheaper thing that they just threw in that said the lightsaber he has is far far more impressive it is it is awesome i love it um they use the same as they did with Vader. It's see-through. It looks like actual flame. I mean, it, it gives that flame look because you can see through it. And his face mold is, is quite excellent. Let me try to tap it so he doesn't look quite so pale. Show you what he actually looks like. Come on. There we go. Now, that's much better than the mold of the previous one. And But the thing is, do you see a scar? I bet you don't see a scar. It's hard to see a scar with your own eyeballs. Remember, he, he got filleted like a fish on, I mean, his down that straight down his nose, forehead and nose, and then it was on that cheek, the right cheek. And there's just a tiny little one, but Ryan, jo Ryan Johnson said that he was going to move the scar because he thought it looked goofy. I think that's idiotic because Everybody was making fun of him because he had no reason to wear a helmet, right? Well, now he'd finally have a reason to wear a helmet and be like his grandfather. He's lost parts of himself. Okay, let's get into the actual review. One thing I want to say, I hate this cape. It's solid PVC. It's, it comes off just like this. Now, I collect Lord of the Rings, right? And this was a toy biz. Uh, they made tons of capes like this always they had somewhere where they had little two little pegs and then in the back or the neck somewhere that's really hidden you get it in and you just would pop it in well this you have to actually get under his hair and if you take a look at him he, his back is straight he's like the hunchback he's hunchbacked and even if i take it off he's still hunchbacked and watch, I can lift his head. The only way I can unhunchback him is if I turn him backwards. <laughs> turn him backwards here. Now let's look at the, the legs. The legs are great. The feet, you're going to have full up, down, pivot. You've got uh, side to side. I don't like the side to side so much because it weakens. You know, it weakens really easily. And he's already been the hardest one to pose. But, much like Darth Maul, he's got a double leg, double leg knee joint. So you can get him to some awesome positions. His skirting doesn't get too much in the way. Let's show you how high we can go. Karate kick. So, as high as you really need. I mean, what are you going to do with him? Have him, you know, fly or whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and take this saber out. It fits. 
This is how it fits, by the way, in one hand. It's very loose, very loose grip. But he never really fights with it one... Well, he does fight with it one-handed, but... Maybe he's changed his game. We'll just say that for now. And then you've got full wrist swivel. You've got double jointed ankles. Or, or <laughs> ankles. Elbows. And then, then you've got... Look at that. Goes all the way in. Goes all the way up. Goes around the earth. So he, he is fully... You know, and let's see if we can do exorcist with him. Yep, we can exorcist him. So he has a, and he stayed tight. Um, and we've got the, the waist swivel. As far as that goes, that makes him an awesome figure. I, my, my, my only complaints are the ankles are very weak. It's very hard to get him to stand. Well, I'll just, just stand him like I did the other two. And he's going. And there, got him. But if I put this on him, if I put his cloak on, why they, I mean, Black Series is known, someone tell me, what logic is there in going with a PVC cape when you're known for using cloth and that's what makes you stand out and cloth would actually make look better and make it fit better. So here's what I'm doing. I'm actually putting it under his hair, I'm pushing his head forward and I'm putting his head back. And then that's how you get, that's how you get it on there. I mean, I can go low with him and make him appear, you know, much shorter than he is. I don't know if you see him. But uh, actually, even with his knees bent, he's taller than he was even with the helmet. So uh, I guess he grew a little as well as having magical moving uh, uh, scars. Uh, which I, I think I'm going to do an exo knife custom on him. And you know, that and get him accurate to episode seven. I mean, that's just that's just <laughs> ridiculous. But you know, for the price, if you can catch it for not for for nineteen ninety nine, I'd say go for it. Don't pay more than nineteen ninety nine. I think he's available on almost every website. Hasbro, blah blah blah. Um, and gosh, I hate that cloak. And. They make Vader's like this. I mean, you would think by now they know how to make a good cloak. I'm trying to fix it off screen. I'm sorry. It it here. I'll poke poke his head back. Then I'll try to get it under his hair. Pull his head back. See, though it still it gives him the hunchback. But you know, we can put it like that. I mean, he 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 would look badass. If I didn't have to hunchback him, that's what he. That's that's the side view. Um, I don't know, but I mean, you can always buy a black cape. I mean, people don't pay sixteen dollars; pay like you know five to ten. But um, and go to or your local toy store or something like that. Somebody will hook you up, or buy an item, buy a six inch, you know, that you like, and you, that you can take the black cape off and just switch back and forth whenever you're displaying. All in all, this is a more accurate look of, of of Adam Driver. It's cool to be able to see his new outfit. I would like to be able to see, like, you know, some way of showing the damage that he took. Didn't she, I, she take off his leg, or maybe she just slashed it? But um, anyway, this is it. Oh my God, thirteen minutes. Time flies by. I did want to show you real quick. I'm not going to take out the box because I'm hanging it on my troop wall. But I did get the uh, executioner, uh, which they also call, I think, the judges. And then Gree is another one I'm not going to open. But if you haven't seen Commander Gree, he is amazing, worth the money. Um, it's funny, they didn't even put their Toys R Us exclusive on there. I don't know what kind of sales, by the way. Toys R Us is going out of business. So, um, check them out and see if they're having deals uh, all right well thank you for watching if you did and please hit that like that subscribe and please look at the description i have some links there to my ebay um uh, i have some links uh other links to my like to my page where i i update and do all kinds of stuff that i, I don't can't just do on youtube um so please uh go to my page and like it if you would 
and um, I hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, so this is Kylo and all his incarnations. By the way, with something funny, Luke's gonna wear four different outfits. We already got this Luke. Oh, another Kylo. We already got this Luke that comes with absolutely nothing. And his face kind of looks like Tyrion Lannister's a little bit. Um, but, so we'll probably get Luke version 2. And that will have come with the uh, long stick thing he's got. That Then there'll probably could be, you know, number 3 that comes with the lightsaber. And then the, the final version of it. I mean, come on, Hasbro Disney. You, you're going to milk us out. We can't all... <laughs> You know, as much as we love Star, I love Star Wars. There's only so many, much. I mean, look at this. This is ridiculous to have this many, and then he'll probably have a change of costume too, and Ray probably will too. And meanwhile, the peg holders, Rose and Finn, will just. It might be all peg holders at some point. Yet Jaina Solo sold out. And by the way, guys, I, I managed to get a pre-order on her. A pre-order on Snoke and his throne, and a pre-order on his elite Praetorian guards. I cannot wait to review those for you. I'm sorry for taking so long. I know it's 16 minutes of your life. I hope it was enjoyable. You guys are the best. I love Star Wars family. Please, if you can, leave me a comment. Give me a like. A subscribe. Um, check out my eBay. I don't scalp. I hunt down and find clearance items. Mark them up, usually to the regular price. And then, or what the value, or the trending value is. And then that way, you know, that way I can feel good knowing that I'm helping fellow collectors. But, I, you know, eBay takes 13% of every sale. And then I have to pay for all the bubble wrap and boxes and stuff like that, too. After all is said and done, you know, I'm, I usually break even or even take a loss. But that's okay. I mean, right now, I... I you know, being able to get any income and, and be able to help people complete their sets. I've got some micro machine things up and stuff like that. So anyway, if there's uh, anything, please leave a comment or go to my page. Uh, Revin JJ number one is the you would just uh, type www.facebook.com slash Revin JJ one. Um, or um, just check the links below. Thank you so much and have a great, great day.